The training program gathers 32 participants, coaches from the respective clubs, amid, amongst others, to adequately prepare the coaches of the COVID-19 guidelines and regulations so as to maintain the safe and health status of players. Speaking at the opening ceremony, GFF Technical Director Sang Ndong described the training as fundamental, noting that capacity building is one of the Federation's core areas to build the competence level of duty bearers. He noted that despite the COVID-19 pandemic, the GFF will continue within its utmost to live by its primary responsibility. We accept that the pandemic is here and we have to cope with it by adhering to the guidelines so that football is also active. So it is important that we train these coaches who can disseminate the message to their respective teams. Technical director call on the coaches to practice the basic WHO and health guidelines on COVID-19 ahead of the resumption of the football in the Gambia. GFF Women's Football Coordinator Seni Susoho Mbai highlighted the significance of the cause, noting that women football development cannot be attained without capacity building. It is a significant activity for women football and there are other programs on the pipeline to be implemented on women's football development. She expressed delight in the progress of women's football since 1994 with a good record of achievements thanks to the Lamin Kababajo-led executive.